there and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here then don't forget to subscribe down below and without much further ado, let's get on with the video. Today's video is extremely chaotic and extremely funny for me anyway. I hope other people are going to laugh at it. Basically, in short, I went to Edinburgh about two weeks ago. When I was in Edinburgh, I actually got in contact with a company called The Cauldron and I was like, hey, do you, do you want to do a like a, a collab of any kind? Like, do you do that kind of thing? And they were like, hell yeah, we can we can gift you a couple of tickets to our experience. So I took them up on that offer, and uh, this is this is the video that um, you're gonna see today. So this video is partly gifted. I was given two free tickets, and then we paid for the other two tickets. So it's one of those ones, a very fun one, and I'm very thankful to The Cauldron for doing this because they didn't have to. Now The Cauldron is a cocktail bar experience that is themed to Harry Potter, wizards, witches, warlocks, magical creatures, all that kind of thing. It is, it's so good. Now, the Cauldron has four locations around the world. You've got one in Dublin, one in London, one in New York, and then one in Edinburgh. And the Edinburgh one is the one that I went to. And another cool thing that they actually do at, I don't know, if it's all of the cauldrons, but just Edinburgh specifically, because I saw it, um, is they actually grow their own like herbs that they use in the potions that you make, which I thought was really cool. And they had like a little garden like inside. It was just really cute. And it kind of adds to that fairy tale story that they are creating in this experience. The experience itself costs $29.99 on off peak. And then it goes up to, I think it's 35 pound on peak day. The staff there were amazing, super friendly, super nice. And the first person we spoke to actually introduced us to our wands because when you go to this experience, you get given a magic wand that actually works actually works um, and she went through the different ones they had and what they kind of meant now of course I filmed my entire experience and I'm going to share that with you it is very misjointed and odd but in short what happened was we were given three drinks the first one comes out of one of the like heads on the wall I think it was a snake a dragon and a lamb the lamb was non-alcoholic which is another thing they do do non-alcoholic options but I will say it is only 18 plus. So if you're under the age of 18, I'm very sorry, but I can't recommend this experience to you yet because they only take 18 over, but you can still enjoy drunk Amelia. Drink responsibly, but drunk Amelia, it's, 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 it's something. And then you go into class and you create your potions, which are obviously your alcoholic beverages, and they are very infused with lavender and me and my sister did not read the instructions properly so you're gonna witness that also even though i make many faces in this video i enjoyed every single one of those drinks they were so strong so alcoholic worth every penny because if you don't know how expensive alcohol is mm, cocktails are usually like 10 quid depending on where you go but like usually like eight to ten is like a cheap cheap cocktail you know so for 30 quid the all three drinks, the experience in a whole, which takes about two hours, I think it was incredibly worth it. So I hope I can share what they do with you guys so then maybe some of you can experience something that you wouldn't necessarily experience. But yeah, I really enjoyed it. I'm gonna shut up here now. Enjoy us making potions and getting drunk. Yeah. Okay, so the bottle of essence. <laughs> Is that? Do we put the whole bottle in? Yeah. Oh, it's pretty. It's a measuring cup for us. My turn. Let's put the whole thing in. Don't say it, you'll die. Cheers. <laughs> Harry and Ron in potions class. Three, two, one, go. You're supposed to use the vial. Oh, Stir wait. Times. <laughs> There's instructions on the floor. We're going to be going off on lavender. <laughs> and on your top right and top left over here, just touch it once, please. Yeah. yeah. Fantastic. Oh, cool. You're going to pour your venom into your potion and say Illumos while you do it, okay? So on three. One, two, three. Illumos. And it's shaded colour. These are both naturals. Illumos. Perfect. What do you think? Is it Ginny? Is it Ginny Weasley? Why I put a bit too much lavender in it? <laughs> Yeah, maybe a bit too much lavender. <laughs> I suddenly feel like a garden. What are you doing, Dad? Come it! Mum, he's not 18. No, he 
he's a baby. He's baby Kermit. You get to grind the herbs. I want to grind the herbs. <clears throat> Open sesame. Oh, that's cute. Oh. <laughs> Hello. Oh, Millie, it's plant. It's good for you. Oh, Who's there? Is that ground enough? <laughs> what is happening? Oh my god. What is happening? My parents, everyone. See him now. Oh my gosh, that was so pure. <laughs> That's so cute! One, One two, two, three, four, four Mississippi. <laughs> what does it smell like? Raisins? Okay, am I putting the whole thing in? Yeah, entire bottle. Let's get crunk. Wizard crunk. <laughs> Ooh, that's really cool. I'm stirring, I'm stirring. I'm also getting real warming in this place because I'm getting alcoholic pepperoni only, only. Oh no, he's come out again. One, two, and sure the ice is right. That's about half a ladle. Right. <laughs> Twelve, thirty, fourteen, fifteen. 40, 50. I'm a pushing my step. Yargo. Why the hold you want when you get drunk? I'm pinky out. That's very lavender. Am I about to absolutely lose my mind? <laughs> what was that face? <laughs> it is Sorry, I just got dad's face just then. <laughs> you guys are pathetic. Oh. Three, two, one. So get the right and it should be infused in the glass as well. It smells like castles. Yes. <laughs> 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 Oh gosh. Oh, fire! This is amazing. They've got dragon's breast. Oh god. There's rum in this. <laughs> Oh, this smells exactly like a reenactment. Can Yeah, that was a very complicated metaphor you said last time. It's a shame nobody got to hear it. I think about that like twice a week. Oh, to quote the Oh, I quite like that one. <laughs> no, Millie, that's the smoky one, not the dragon one. This one's. <laughs> that one's stronger. That one's rum. Yeah. I'm drinking my palate cleanser. 
Thank you, Arthur, for your spit. Out of context, that sounds so weird. Arthur's, Arthur's, the, Arthur's the dragon over there in the background. Fire! The smelly smell. Smell. Oh God, smelly. What did you just say? He said, oh god, that gets really strong if you like truly like snip it. <laughs> it's like power aid. I drank death, guys. So did you. We are Voldemort. <gasps> Control, that meant you control, 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 I don't know. I think I have gooseberry and cinnamon yogurt. Or quick sticks. Would you like a gooseberry and cinnamon yogurt? Do you want any more of this one? My accent just went weird. My accent just went a bit wobbly. Do you want any more of this? Are you sure? I'm fine. Yeah. No, 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 no. I'm fine is not okay. This is a matter of do you want any more? I'll have a tiny sip more. Is it true? <laughs> we mix up the potion. Scary stories. <laughs> oh god, that lemon. I was like, I just ate a lemon. Like an actual lemon. Well, yeah. That and also, my name is Mel. Well, okay. I'll just spit the great. Oh. Oh, I feel like I'm in uni again. A little bit tipsy. Why are you, you ever, drunk like, on the road? Do you ever realise how big your mouth is? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Amazing! That's an ancient scientific fact! Are you quite down? Cool. Could we like grab like a bottle of rum on the way back? No. I should have brought my bottle around because I got one. Are you going to get a few? It's very ominous. Yeah, delayed reaction. Right? Really, really help. Really help. Back to your hand. You look worse for wear. <laughs> this is what we call oh, a lightweight. Hey. I am not a lightweight. Well, I think you are. <laughs> Drink up the last bit then, Millie. I'm 20. I just had like a like a, like a moment. Like your alcohol. I'm imagining the um magneto thing where it pulls the iron out of the guy's blood, so it's alcohol. Freeze your brain. Aguamente. And there you go. That is the uh, mess that was the cauldron. But I enjoyed myself so much, and I really, really want to experience the London one at some point. So, London friends. If you wanna, if you wanna get on that, and you wanna go and make some potions, be wizards and witches, like I'm ready. If anyone is actually interested in going to the cauldron and experiencing this, I will leave all of the links in the description to like their website and their Instagram, and just you guys can go and check it out yourself because I really loved it. I would recommend it 100%. Everyone was super nice. I'm gonna stop talking now. Let you guys go and enjoy your Sunday evenings or whatever day it is for you when you actually watch this. But yes. If you enjoyed today's video and you want to carry on watching this face, I do Disney videos, review videos, reaction videos, a lot of videos, then please do not forget to subscribe just here, then click on my previous video just here, and here will be a link to a recommended video, but until next time, bye!